this is this is going to be a disaster. <laughs> that's okay. the first I word quit. you always want to hear. <laughs> I quit. Somebody explain to me why every time we go live, it says we've been live for 30 seconds. Welcome to you our disaster. Uh, it's the that. time change. It's the time zone. <laughs> yeah, it's, yeah. A, it's uh, Eastern time. Incre yeah. Incremental time differences. Mm -hmm. like, it seems like we've already been live for 30 seconds. Yeah, But it's only been 27. Show. Right. Yeah, I was looking at time zones in Europe the other day and like, from Amsterdam to Berlin is one minute difference. It's like when it's three o'clock in the afternoon in it's Berlin, 301. it's three o one in Amsterdam. So, hmm. so plan accordingly. Plan accordingly. <laughs> That's right. Leave when a minute early. You need exactly. to get that three o four train. Leave a minute early. Mm -hmm. That's right. <laughs> you are sixty seconds late. I knew it. I knew I'm from you Amsterdam. Be... Yep. <laughs> Always a minute late. <laughs> uh oh, Rachel! Dollars short. Rachel's mad. We oh, didn't no. start early. Yeah, knew, we were so busy talking in the comment section. I and knew it. I'm from Amsterdam, Rachel. Story. Sorry. <laughs> I called it. I said everybody's going to be mad. I, actually, and I was thinking the King sisters are going to be mad. That's everybody. And that's exactly right. <laughs> everybody important. We'll oh wow! Um, An Australian phrase-based sea shanty. That's a great what? idea. Look, JT, there's my sister. Yeah, it's she can't get over it. <laughs> <laughs> so, Tabby's making fun of me because last year when we did Oakstober, I could not for the life of me remember what we called it. Every single week I'd try to say the, se the segment name and I would botch it in some new way. And that was one of the versions. I was like, was tonight we're doing our... Oxpooker again. No, that's not right. It's one of her preferred ways to botch it. <laughs> okay. Yep, yep. We got we got so much to do. I'm getting ahead of myself. I shouldn't talk about it. But yeah, we were we were a little late because we were setting stuff up. I had a sound problem, and I've been uh, I've been doing uh, rescue work, like disaster oh, rescue. Wow. I've been a first responder today. That's awesome. Yeah, what? we had. Well, I didn't actually save any people <laughs> or living creatures, but I. Uh, the, it was pouring. Did it rain super hard at your place, Peach? Yes, it did. And everybody who was here, Megan and Tabby and their families, dashed out the door. Tabby's windows were open at her house, so they ran quickly back home. And it yeah, was it a came down deluge. Hard. Yeah, it was. It was just in buckets. And then, uh, so trying to get home, the the streets in the in town were like rivers. I mean, I'm not kidding. They were they were like flowing. Yeah. And. Uh, so I went out into the into the thunderstorm, and uh, and unplugged the storm drains, for uh, our side of the street, the other side of the street, and then the people kitty corner and across the street. I did the entire quadrant um, yeah. with my bare hands. Okay. I un I unplugged. That has it. been as long as I've known you. That's been one of your favorite things in the world to do. So I love doing it, but I wanted to make it sound like it was heroic. I wanted to make as it much sound... as you want credit for that. <laughs> Not I'm all heroes wear say. capes, John Brady. Not all heroes wear capes. No, some of them wear swim shoes, which is what yeah. I was doing. Some of them wear really speedos. <laughs> some heroes wear speedos. Um, yeah, I didn't. I just put on some shorts. It's Oaks Tober! It's Oaks Tober, everybody! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Listen to those horns. I love horns. Merry October. God Kicking bless us, everyone. Yep. Happy October. We're going to need to decide if it's merry or happy. Are you ready for the show? I am so ready for the show. I hope everyone brought their October gift. Are you ready for the show? I'm registered. Is there a white Are elephant in the show? <laughs> The, uh, but we call it a yellow walrus. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> yellow. Cuckoo cuckoo. <laughs> the Eggman. Uh, 
Oh, golly. Kicking it live, so be our guest. Everybody gonna be so blessed. Hoping you cats gonna be impressed. Ain't no time to be depressed. Are you ready for the best? For the best. How much of a delay do we have? So when like, I sing along, is it? Is it? It's not good. It's not, not good. good. <laughs> yeah, not good was, at all. I like the way she hung around long enough to say that. Come and in, then just, just... <laughs> with the knife and then take off. <laughs> <laughs> it's not good. I'm out. Welcome to Skews. Uh, my name is John, and I am the uh, heroic first responder and host tonight. <laughs> um, also with us is Brian April. Always with us, the uh, ever ever popular. Brian April and John Thomas Oaks, JT, is with us. Uh, Juwan DeVivo is supposed to be here, but he's going to be sliding in late because he, as you know, is on the road. He tours with a little band called Casting Crowns, and uh, their continued success has always been the bane of this show. Right? Yep, he's out. Think we just got to break them up. That's, that's mm -hmm. it. We just have to to break them up and uh so he can be on the show <laughs> listen to us <laughs> plotting, <laughs> plotting the breakup of casting crowns so that we can have Joanna on our show i'm not sure that that is christian uh Russ Noonan wants to be just like me. Mm. Well, you're going to have to get some swim socks and you're going to have to go outside and unplug the storm drains. <laughs> <laughs> and that's, that's really it. That's one. all you do. If you do that, yeah. Step one to becoming yep. like John Brannion. <laughs> step right. one. Yep. It's really the most important step. So uh, we've got so many things to do tonight that I'm a little bit apprehensive. I'm a little, oh, I'm a little scared to even get started. I'm, I'm scared. Don't be scared. It's, don't be scared. It's don't, uh, be, don't be scared, John. It's it's Oaktober, um, yes, which is a little thing that we did last year when we did Oaktober. JT wasn't even officially part of our merry band. He was just a he was a hired gun. He was a he was a uh, an out of towner. He's a no, but I'm now. A yeah, now he's he's part of the group, and so October is actually officially uh, an in-house phenomenon, and so we're gonna get we're gonna get right to it. We have a uh, a tremendous show. No, we're gonna do the clickers first. All right. Okay. Uh, rather before before we do anything else, we're gonna say shout out to our clickers. Clickers are great. They're super amazingly great. Athletic and fun and super smart. Their beautiful faces a work of art. Clickers are great. They're witty and stunningly great. Without them we'd be destitute and drifting into the abyss. Lovely clickers, we blow you a kiss. Some people like to gather treats and other folks are trickers. We love them both, but now let's give a scream to all the clickers. Ah! Uh, this week our clickers, our clickers in no particular order are... Todd Copeland and Larry... York. Thank you uh, to Todd and Larry both, and thank you to all of our clickers who make this show possible. If you would like to be a clicker and have your name sung in a minor key, um, <laughs> then you're going to have to go quickly to johnbrandy.com and become a clicker because... Uh, because Oaktober is just a it's, a, it's a mist, it's a vapor. It's here today and gone tomorrow. It's just through the month of October. Uh, go to johnbrandy.com. We appreciate all of your support and your uh, enthusiastic money. <laughs> uh, and congratulations also to JT for, uh, for coming up with yet another rhyme. Thank you. I know that's, yeah. we're, we're about what, 20, mm. 20 something weeks now? I think so. Yeah, I keep finding them. 
he keeps he finding them. Find <laughs> and it even fit with the theme tonight. Yeah. That's the yeah, thing. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, the effort party is a thing that we uh, that we do where we kick back after the show and uh, members uh, of the click are welcome to join us while we plot next week's show. And uh, and sometimes we don't do that at all. Sometimes we just horse around for mm -hmm. a while until until we have to leave. So, uh, OK, we've taken care of that. Now we do have a gigantic show tonight. Um, How big is it? Lest you forget. I'm glad you asked, JT. Tonight's show uh is gigantic if you were to <laughs> if you were to represent the usual show with this woolly mammoth tonight's show in comparison looks something like this Ooh, that is a big show that's mm -hmm. really big that's a huge yeah. show that's, that's amazing really that's like halloween big mm -hmm. i uh i tried to pick a jack-o-lantern that was sort of menacing i mean i didn't want a happy jack-o-lantern uh-huh <laughs> but at the same time i didn't want something that was going to be grotesque and and frightening because i know jt is going to sing his songs and i didn't want to uh -huh. be so okay so let's take a, this a jack o'lantern quick... looks a little bit like dazed and confused and like sort of frightened like, yeah, he's in awe, mean, like... it's like juan's chickens yeah, like, <laughs> this is how big the show is <laughs> Well, that was my question. Uh, to just take a quick survey. If you're when you're carving a jack o' lantern, is it better to have a jack o' lantern that's scary or a jack o' lantern that's like happy? Because you see both kinds. You see the sort of happy, friendly jack o' lanterns, yeah. and then you yeah. see the menacing jack o' lanterns. And which one, which one's better? Well, I think the happy ones widen your audience a little bit. You know, you make think so? more people likely to come, come in, and you know, that's just an opinion. I like well, the ones where they do like both sides. Well, they'll do like one side will be the happy side, and then the other side is the, like the angry side or the oh yeah, the, yeah, the scarier those. side. Yeah, those are good. Like a like a schizophrenic jack o' lantern. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I like uh, I like some of the jack o' lanterns that are that are not as serious, uh, not necessarily the happy ones. The best jack o' lantern that I've seen, and uh, I wanted to do it one year, but I. I just never have. It's a guy. It, it's the face looks like it's like this, and it had they've taken the insides of the pumpkin and they're coming out of the mouth like mm -hmm. he's puking. Oh yeah, I've seen that yeah, one. That's, that's really a good cool. one. Yeah, I like that one. We should um, we should do a, a search of like the weirdest jack o' lantern faces, like just different expressions. Uh, yes. Um, yeah. Well, we could do that. We should carve a jack o' lantern one That'd week. Thank you. <laughs> Can we do that? Why not? You... Juwan has arrived backstage. What are you frantically pointing? Well, why didn't you bring him out? <laughs> you, is he waiting for well, the introduction? You're on the bus, man. I recognize yeah, the bus. My, our Wi-Fi is non-existent, so I'm on my phone. So we don't know how this is going <laughs> to come at home again. Uh, it seems to be working. What are you eating for dinner? Uh, some. some <laughs> Meat product over rice <laughs> with gravy. Meat product over rice. <laughs> it's glamorous out here. and hundred percent pampering out here all the time. Um, <laughs> so happy jack o' lanterns or scary jack o' lanterns before we move on? Which is it? Which is better? I know you have I like an the opinion. Ones with, me? Uh, I know. I like the ones without mouths. <laughs> 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 I have no idea what they're thinking. <laughs> what's going through their pumpkin heads. Yeah. <laughs> I thought the one that John put up for the show tonight looked like one of your chickens, Juwan. Yeah, he Which didn't one? see it. Yeah, I didn't, didn't see, see the it. pumpkin. Yeah, there it is. Uh, yeah. <laughs> he thought it looked a little confused and frightened. Mildly, yeah, mildly agitated. <laughs> the pondering um, pumpkins, that's what they need. I actually oh, yeah. got the cat app and used it on my chickens. What What was the, uh, I need to know their emotion. What emotion did they have? Shake of Aller had used it on his chickens. Did it work? That's what I'm wondering. The, uh -oh. Their emotions are usually uh, shocked <laughs> and um, confused. Yeah, that's their two emotions. We, we will... We, we need to have that segment on skews. We need, we need somebody to do that. Somebody. With us, yeah. 
somebody, and I'm looking at you. Someone who has chickens. Um, <laughs> well, we could do it with a cat and then do do a chicken and see if chickens feel the same as cats. So we could do like a... Oh, yeah. You know, if they have the same emotions. Just go to the zoo. It. We could just go live at the zoo and just find different... Okay, here's a mountain lion, and then we can <laughs> do the mountain lion. Then we go to the mm -hmm. elephant. Yes. And we see mm -hmm. if the cat app works on the elephant. And, My uh, gosh. Maybe like a beluga whale. That would yeah. be a really good one <laughs> to try to do. I think. What's this fish you feeling? Just... <laughs> <laughs> you just <laughs> you just wanted to just say beluga. I did. <laughs> uh, Tabby says she can use Andrew's cat. Okay, we are uh, going to do a mad lib tonight and i'm not sure if that is uh what do, what do we need to do to get that rolling i know that we i know that we are ill prepared for that so, <laughs> so uh do we want here's what i was asking no because uh -huh. you you mentioned that you could write a script uh-huh i did did you but, get it uh, i didn't crud i didn't get it but I do have another script. <laughs> I have another script that we I don't think we've done. So I, I sent that via Telegram. But uh so I, I sent that over to you guys. I don't know how to do this thing. Is Can you get your phone. email? It's in your the, the script I sent was in your email. But oh, if you God. haven't if if you haven't had a chance to do the the boxing out of the words yet, then it's it's probably we'll probably okay. have to do the, Well I got an old one with that we've never done. So I sent that over. I sent that over uh, Telegram. I could send that email too, but okay. While we do something else. <laughs> well, we can do that. While, we can do that while we. we JT is going to do. Uh, oh yeah. JT is going to do some music, and uh, and we are going to do a couple of a couple of things with Scribble Knots because Scribble Knots has a haunted house. Oh, and, nice. Ooh, yeah, that's like cool a gift perfect from god because he is good and so we're going to do that so you have a little time to uh to prep if you and and the producer want to want to do that but we have <laughs> I, didn't, okay. I just noticed where my phone is positioned it's like you guys yeah, <laughs> yeah. 90s well we 90s have, computer hacker movie the right. Right. yeah i'll reroute the encryption do. codes <laughs> And it's zoom in on the diving. password. All right, so we're going to do a Chubby Bruce sketch. Um, and uh, the idea was we were going to put a Chubby Chubby Bruce scene together, a little sketch, and we were going to do it like a Mad Lib. And uh, there's virtually no chance that this is going to work um, <laughs> efficiently and effectively. And uh, the fact that we... That Juwan's been on the road, and and he didn't get my email. And do the you, producers... Could you do polo right now, Juwan, if I take you out of the stream yard stream? Yeah, that, I'd have to basically just leave and then do polo. Okay. So you can't do them at the same I'll time. I'll just leave now. Okay, let's so, chat like back. Let's so you chat guys are going to go backstage. Okay. Okay, so this is going to be the fun. The show is just so now, evolving. Yeah, right one of the major our... one of the major things we were going we to do in the show is we haven't now... talked about Brian's backdrop though yet. We need to do that oh, too. That's true. Yeah, see if this anybody can guess. Picture. Oh, yeah. it's a monster movie. Wow! <laughs> How did you come to that, John? How do you do it? I didn't see the first. Oh, the first uh, one. The, here you go. the first here. picture. Here you go. This is the first picture. So that is uh, uh, Richard Benjamin. Oh, you recognize the actor's name, right? Yeah, Be uh, Richard Benjamin. I recognize because when I was a kid in elementary school, uh, Quark was my favorite uh, sitcom, and Richard Benjamin was in Quark. There. Okay, you okay. remember Quark? Yeah, it is, it is not creature from the Black Lagoon. It is not. It's no, even though it looks like it. But it Richard Benjamin, not Swamp Thing, and he is in. The, is it? Uh, is it Chud? It is not Chud. cannibalistic humanoid underground dwellers. It is not actually Jeff uh, <laughs> Jeffrey Lynn got it. I started watching that the other night. I can't believe you brought Chud. Up. Oh, Saturday the fourteenth. Mm -hmm. Which was a uh, a spoof of the nineteen thirties nineteen forties horror movies. 
mm -hmm. with uh, Jeffrey Tambor, who you can see uh, over my shoulder, and this lady, who you can Jeffrey also Tambor. see over my shoulder. Uh -huh. Who is that? Let's just say uh, Angelica Houston. I don't know. Yeah, it could, be a young, <laughs> could be a young Angelica Houston. Saturday the 14th. Mm -hmm. Cool. With Richard Benjamin, Classic. who was the comedic actor of the late 70s, early 80s. Yeah. Mid-70s, actually. Is he still doing anything? I Like living? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Going to the grocery store? <laughs> shopping <laughs> having his oil changed is he doing anything i got a friend who works down at costco in nashville and he said it's amazing how many washed up superstars come in there to buy flat screen tvs from him. <laughs> really he's got, a, he's got a little list of all these people who used to be famous you know who come into costco and buy appliances and what they him. buy yeah, yeah. <laughs> fame it's so we fickle. Had, we had a few people yeah. guess it's saturday the 14th so that's good yeah well it's it's funny how um you know we we say we use terms like washed up or whatever and some of them are, but you know it doesn't last very long no They're it very, doesn't most yeah. of the most of the actors and actresses most of the people in hollywood you know are they're recognizable but very few of them become like george clooney or right, uh, right. Clint Jack eastwood or, yeah 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 it's true very few Sometimes I'll go back and watch a movie from the '90s or something, and I'll see somebody, and I'll think, "Wow, they were that was they were great in that," and then nothing. Yeah. So. Yeah. Yeah. It's kind of I know, like Richard Hollywood. Benjamin in yeah, Saturday Hollywood the Fourteenth. Kind of yeah, scrapes exactly. it off, scrapes and scrapes them off of their shoe on the way out. Yeah, so. they're done with them. <laughs> Sad. Onto younger people, and I'm I would I don't know if uh, if there is going to be any superstars in the future because hmm. you know media is. There's so many different kinds of media and direct to direct to video and and movies right. and everything is kind of breaking into its own little everything's sort of got its own little universe that it's uh -huh. breaking into i don't know if there's going to be a, a a possibility of becoming like this recognizable celebrity in the yeah. future <clears throat> interesting conversation well and most of the uh, the movies too are just they're just rehashing like action superhero type movies so you're not really getting you know, yeah. one flew over the cuckoo's nest. That's you're true. not getting, you know, uh -huh. anything like that. So you're you're just getting, oh, it's Avengers 17. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. Daniel Craig is not going to be James Bond anymore. So yeah. I yeah. can't imagine. And I guess James Bond's going to be a woman, but we're getting off track. Um, <laughs> so I didn't want to live long enough to see James Bond become a woman. <laughs> <laughs> but I did. It's just Roger Moore wearing a wig. <laughs> uh, now I know Roger Moore's not alive anymore. Oh, okay. so, well, that would be um, a really interesting movie then. Um, it would be <laughs> Weekend at James Bond's. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's what it would be. Weekend at Bernie's has a uh, a scene in it that made me laugh as, as hard or harder than I've ever laughed at anything. Where he's really? skiing. Yeah, he's skiing. Uh huh. And and uh, and he's dead, and as they're dragging <laughs> along behind, he's like banging off of the buoys. <laughs> <laughs> and for some reason, I could not maintain my composure watching that. Um, all right, so you are here to tell us something, I assume. Just Amanda. the update. So we're going to make the Mad Libs work, but Juwan has to fill in the blanks real quick. So it, it okay. might be a little bit. So if we want to move on to our... Um, Scribble knots or whatever other segment gonna, you had. We'll do that. Are, okay. So, and you're going to do? Are we using the one that I wrote? Or are we using the one that? Yeah. Okay. Get the okay. Halloween theme that involves Chubby Bruce Chubby characters. Bruce. It's a go. That's it's a go. We got a green light. It's still nice. going to be an absolute train wreck, but that's yes, that's what you guys are tuned in for. We are releasing the train down the track. <laughs> Release <laughs> the train track. We're leaving the station. It is a go. <laughs> Full ahead. <laughs> All aboard for mayhem and death. Yeah. <laughs> ding, 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 ding. <laughs> there goes the trolley. Okay, uh, JT, our, uh, you have come prepared to scare us out yes. of our uh, socks tonight. I have, okay. yes, I have. Okay, so go ahead and give the background on this and, and give the warning like you always do. We, you know, we give fair warnings to give people a chance to 
Yeah, if you if you are the slightest bit squeamish or if you are prone to nightmares, you just need to turn it off right now. <laughs> Go in the other room, turn your volume down, because I'm going to talk about some things that are just horrifyingly <laughs> dreadful. And you, you may you may not recover from this. So I'm just giving you fair warning right on the front end. And there are lots of things that you should be drawn to in life. But this is a list of things that you should not be drawn to. So back by popular demand, ladies and gentlemen. When days are dark and nights are black, the week before November, and tales of dread and deep despair are all you can remember. When shades of red surround the moon and shadows steal the light, if you should meet a sharp-toothed man, don't try to be polite, cause he's Dracula. He'll try to bite your neck. He'll hypnotize you, drink your blood, and leave you in a wreck. So stay away from Dracula's castle. You will be killed if you venture inside. Terror awaits you in Dracula's castle, where there is no place to hide. Stay away from Frankenstein's dungeon. You will be killed if you venture inside. Terror awaits you in Frankenstein's dungeon, where there is no place to hide. Frankenstein lives with his bride in a basement, waiting for humans to walk through his door. When he is finished destroying their bodies, they don't look like humans no more. So stay away from from Transylvania, you will be killed if you venture inside. Terror awaits you in Transylvania, where there is no place to hide. When children come to trick or treat and wear their scary masks, you'll notice one is drinking from a laboratory flask. Slam the door and lock it tight. Don't even ask him in, or you may never live to open any doors again. Because he's Dr. Jekyll, he'll change to Mr. Hyde. He'll drain your blood and fill your body with formaldehyde. So stay away from the lab of Dr. Jekyll. You will be killed if you venture inside. Terror will the lab of Dr. Jekyll, where there is no place to hide. And stay away from the crypt of the zombie. You will be killed if you venture inside. Terror awaits in the crypt of the zombie, where there is no place to hide. Zombies are dead, but they feed on the living. They'll eat you up from your head to your hands. If one calls and asks you to join him for supper, hey, tell him you have other plans. Yeah, and stay away from the tomb of the mummy. You will be killed if you venture inside. Terror awaits in the tomb of the mummy, where there is no place to hide. In space there lives an evil man who rules a dark domain. <laughs> there goes Tommy. <laughs> he built a planet of his own because he is insane. <laughs> and if you're captured by his troops and thrown before his feet, be courteous and tell him that you think he's really sweet. Cause he's Darth Vader You'd better not complain He'll cut you with his lightsaber And cause you lots of pain So stay away from the Death Star space station You will be killed if you venture inside Terror awaits at the Death Star space station where there is no place to hide. This is serious. <laughs> Stay away from Cujo's doghouse. You will be killed if you venture inside. Terror awaits you in Cujo's doghouse. Where there is no place to 
too high. Cujo's a dog with a bad case of rabies. He'll eat you up. He you don't know what to do. Don't try to give him a milk bone dog biscuit. He'll take your arm with it too. So stay away from Stephen King's basement. You will be killed if you venture inside. Terror awaits you in Stephen King's basement. I know this from experience. Where there is no place to hide. Where there is no place to hide. <laughs> where there is no place. Where there is no place. Where there is no place to hide. No place to hide. Look out, Wolfman. Uh, Thank you. Very good. <laughs> the, uh, the practical effects were impressing everybody. I thought he was like trying to pretend it like was like the blob or something, you know, like from the movie The Blob. And then he just started pulling things out. And I'm like, oh, he just went to the swap meet and is showing us what he bought. <laughs> like, he's just, I got a calendar. I got the, <laughs> you know, pull out groceries next. Just <laughs> thank you. What, what's that yes, yeah. yeah, we got a special appearance by Sarah Michelle Galar and everything. Uh -huh. <laughs> All you Buffy fans out there, Buffy, Buffy the Vampire fans. Slayer. Yeah. yeah. So. It was, uh, it was an interesting dichotomy. You know, we're talking about scary things, and then Sarah Michelle pops up, and she's not, <laughs> she's not super scary, but she I lives guess in it a scary world. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, great. Great, JT. And also, hat tip to Tommy, too. I don't know yes. if that was a spontaneous. It was fun of the spirit. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't even know they were going to be here. I, I kind of I kind of thought it was when he came with the trash bag on his arm and just started. I'm like, okay. And then the, and then he went back into the house and found up, you know, just found some other things that he thought would be, <laughs> thought would be scary. Important. Things we needed mm -hmm. to see. Con actually wrote, oh, no, a garbage bag. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no! no not oh, Tabith, Tabith is correcting me on my facts and the lyrics here too. What is that? Oh, with Frankenstein. Frankenstein. Yeah. yeah, being the doctor himself. Yes, this is true. Yeah, is the doctor yeah. or even an or? What a nerdy thing to say. That's <laughs> it's true. What a nitpicky nerdy thing to say. She's <laughs> pregnant. She's allowed to be nitpicky. <laughs> she is. Um. Okay, that was and and all through the month of uh, October, we have a different scary song or something, some sort of a scary presentation. Didn't oh, yeah. you guys do uh, the Sam McGee? We did. Last year? Do we you did. and Brian? Yeah. Mm -hmm. We did. Mm -hmm. It yep. was not Sam McGee last no, year. Snape McGee. Snape McGee. Snape McGee. Snape. Uh, the cremation of Snape McGee. Oh, that's right. <laughs> that's right. Yes. Okay. We have an update, I'm assuming. <laughs> From Juwan. From from Juwan. Well, let's get to it. How's it going, road dog? <laughs> <laughs> can he hear you? I think I can hear him. It's like the news. Bus. We have an update live. Let's go to Juwan, who's on his phone right now. Juwan to Vivo in the Casting Crowns tour bus. <laughs> can you hear us, Juwan? Juwan. I don't think he can. Okay, maybe he can't. <laughs> oh, okay. We seem to be having... Uh, we'll check back in. This was a, it was a great cool. idea. <laughs> He's just going... A great idea like for us to put 80% of the show on Juwan's shoulders <laughs> while he's traveling. Um, all right. Fortunately, uh, Scribble Knots has a haunted house, so I'm going to pull that up. Yay. Um, right? Oh, I? okay. I have to go listen to Juwan's polo. I'll be back. <laughs> okay. You go, you go ahead, little lady. Real time. It's all um, happening, folks, right here in real time, right before your very eyes. television magic unfold. That's even right. It's happening. Television. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that looks like uh, something from Where the Wild Things Are. It does, mm -hmm. doesn't it? Doesn't it? It's the full stop diner. Guy. Yeah. Yeah, so I'm, I'm going to move us over. Now, usually the reason I have to switch back 
and talk to you like this is because if I try to talk to you while the game is running, apparently my voice speeds up. Is that what you yes. have said? It like it like talks really fast. Yeah, it like buffers um, and then you come up there and go really fast. Okay. <laughs> well, let me go back to this then. Um, um Grave Manor. Grave Manor. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, that can you guys spooky. hear the sound effects? No. no. No? I don't want to. That's scary enough without them. Okay. I think when you click into that browser, then it'll, it might kick in. It's horrifying. Okay. Let me we'll try. See. This looks like can a place we need. We should stay away from, actually. Stay away from Grave Manor. Look mm -hmm. at those little people. I wonder what they do. Ooh, they, ooh. they represent... The lollipop kill, the lollipop kill. <laughs> and that mirror is stinky or something. Yeah, they they remind me of the twins from The Shining. Mm. And what's that thing in the, in the other room there with the wings? Oh, it's a little, like, ghost demon. Ooh. I don't know what it is. It's creepy. What should we add to it? What adjective should we add? <laughs> uh, how about, um... Uh, ecstatic. <laughs> I don't know how to spell that. <laughs> it's a C. It's a C. E E E C S T A T I C. Yeah, look, like ec ecstatic. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't do anything. What about mopey? Mopey. Just, that'd be really for like a mopey little demon ghost. <laughs> Just sad. Okay, so. This guy wants us to deliver him from evil. It's a it's a priest who wants us to deliver him from evil. So why is he asking us? He should be asking the Lord for that. So should we should we, we send him to like an Amazon the, box? <laughs> should we put the Lord in there? Should we put the Lord in there and see what? Try it, yeah. Try it. Okay. Or a Bible? Give him a Bible. It doesn't take Bible if. Yeah, I'm going to bet that it's not going to come up with a depiction of Jesus, but <laughs> I could be wrong. <laughs> Exfoliating. No, they didn't include Jesus. Yeah. There's James, though. There's Jason. That's the brother of Jesus. That's right. That's right. Douse something with holy he... water. They might do holy water. That might... yeah. What was that? Yeah. Did... Dry holy water. <laughs> Why did James throw dynamite at that mirror? <laughs> what James know. is it? Well, I figured it was one of the apostles. So, <laughs> with a turkey's hat. To... <laughs> with and... a goatee and a, and a baseball. Boy, and why is he going and punching that mirror? I'm going to get rid of James. He's more hostile James than I... Violent. He, he doesn't like who he sees, who he's become. So he's fighting himself <laughs> in the mirror. Yes, right. I agree, Rachel. If it won't do the Bible, it probably won't do the Lord. That's right. Uh... Try Jeff. Yeshua. Jeff, I don't think that changing <laughs> languages is going to fix this, but yeah. Okay. Yacht. Yacht. I can well, sail away. delivered that way. Come sail away. Come sail away. Yeah, it won't work. You could, it could try, do holy water, though. Do holy water. Try it. I can see oh. that. Yep. Yeah. yeah, there we go. Yep, yep, yep. Can you Throw. combine it in like a, a like a squirt gun? <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh no! Oh, what? Now what? Oh, oh now goodness. he's coming to life. The holy water brought the demon the holy water out of the life. dark. Stronger. <laughs> holy water hose. Yes. <laughs> oh, that's great. Uh, pick up. Uh, oh, I don't know what to do. Attach it to. To the bottle of holy water. You need to attack it. Attach it to the holy water, right? Yes. So you can spray it. But he already threw the holy water at the priest. Yeah. You need a pool of holy water. <laughs> <laughs> Is that a holy hose? Does it have a halo a holy on the hose? It's it like a kid leash. It's, it's yeah. one of the, it has a halo. One of the kid leashes you see at the mall. <laughs> I can't pull this thing. He is determined to... He's determined to get that... Uh, okay, you guys tell me what to do. Throw the holy water at the demon, not at the priest. Yeah, yeah, he threw it at the, the priest. Holy water... Yeah, okay. Yeah. 
There we go. And throw it at the priest? No, no, no at the priest. Give it to the priest. Give it to... Oh! Whoa! Yay! <laughs> Alright, it worked! This house is clean. It Father says. O'Malley, come on over here, you demon. <laughs> oh, look, there's some little behind. Fucking... Yeah, that's that's funny, Russ. That's well, like I can, I can fly around with those demon wings. <laughs> <laughs> that seems ill-advised. <laughs> yeah, it does. <laughs> what could possibly that's go what Rachel wear its wings like a trophy. I believe <laughs> that's what he was doing. Yep. <laughs> The the holy water hose didn't work like I thought it would, and that way you're you're telling all the other demons, look out, look what look what'll happen to you. Is this your little <laughs> demon friend? Look what I did to him. That's right. Okay, so, we can't see our reflection because this mirror is dirty. Is it because of that, or is it because you're a vampire? Ah. Oh. Can you see your reflection? Dirty mirror. Oh, dirty mirror. So that's the next goal to clean the mirror. Can you use Can we holy get the water back and give him like some Windex? <laughs> you use holy water on every single <laughs> puzzle in the game. Mm -hmm. There's nothing holy water won't fix. Yeah, it didn't work. <laughs> but if this doesn't work, we should try Billy Mays. Billy Mays. <laughs> <laughs> ah, darn. What a shock. Uh, Skip this. Someone get just... him a ShamWow. Billy. What's what that? Just typed in Billy and it gave me that. What is it? I don't know. It's like a it's like a bucket, paint bucket. It's weird. OxyClean. That's what it is. It's, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's, it's OxyClean. That's weird. Maybe a squeegee. All See right, if a squeegee so... will pop yeah. up. Uh, you use the orbit Windex. Uh, squeegee. There it is. Yeah, that'll work. That's got to work. Yeah, that'll that should do it. <laughs> Michael Jackson, he's looking at Yay! the Yay! Oh, oh, a nice little friend. twin came out of there. Ooh, I thought the house was clean. I'm going to squeegee him. Oh, I'm going to give him the squeegee. There. You have the squeegee. I'm going to take this. Is that a, What's that, in a notebook? Yeah, it's my notebook. Is there anything written in it? The, it's the notebook that we use to make objects and things. Oh, okay. Oh, your your twin stole it? Yeah. Oh, that's he's... why it's called Scribble Knots. Because you scribble evil. in your notebook. Mm. Yeah. Okay. I'm starting to get the hang of it now. I'm going to give him the wings because he's evil already. There we go. <laughs> okay. Let's do. Uh... He must not be that evil because the uh, the priest didn't say the house is. What is this dude? What, are... Is anybody too scared? Do we need to stop this? <laughs> <laughs> I may not sleep tonight, but. I'm, I'm game. I wonder if Frankenstein's in here. Frankenstein's monster. monster. Correction, That's right. Tabby. Not did Frank I spell it right? Her, Frank. You did. Is yeah. it? No, E-I-N. E-I-N. It's Frankenstein, right? Yeah. Frankenstein. Frankenstein. He's not in there. Frau what Blucher. About? Try Frau Blucher. Yeah. No, try <laughs> Frankenstein's monster. That's not going to work. Oh, this uh, is kind of off the subject, but I was listening to Car Talk today, you know, click and clack. And they talked about the guy who went up in the weather balloons on his lawn chair. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, no. We were talking about last week. Is his name Larry or what was it? Lawn Larry chair? Elder. Larry Elder. Yeah. I think. No, no. Larry, Larry Elder. Elder. <laughs> Larry Elder's the guy who was running against Gavin Newsom. Yeah. Uh... A weather balloon. What, what the heck you... is that? That's a UFO. What are you doing over there? <laughs> is, it, is your doppelganger making weird stuff with your notebook? That's what Rachel said and and no. Julia said that he'll start making weird stuff with your notebook. The okay. evil twin makes random stuff. Look at oh, that look balloon. That one little balloon lifted that whole lawn That's chair. A powerful off the... balloon. Yeah. That's amazing. I'm going to take it out here. Oh, what happened? Nope. Oh. It detached itself. It'll go all the way up to the... Yep. There <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye. All right. Uh, I want to talk to this... Where'd those little kids go? Oh, they're right there. Okay. 
Come play with us. He would love something to play with. Yeah, <laughs> do. So we need to make something. Your that... soul. Put what? Maxwell's soul. <laughs> there you go. Give the kids something to play with. Oh. Ooh. Well, something happened. Possessed them, apparently. Like, it's like they absorbed my soul. Weird. Oh, the other twin got dynamited. There were two kids. And oh, both. okay. James. I didn't see that happen. James. James, James the brother of Jesus. James. Dynamited. Whatever twin. that is, blew up the twins. Oh, no. Tabby says Play Doh. <laughs> Jack's wife says a serrated knife. Yeah, I was thinking like a chainsaw. Give him a little, like. <laughs> Nope. Is it two R's? Or is it just one? Sedated. Get us a sedated knife. <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna... This is... <laughs> oh, that's, that's hysterical. Oh, because it's sleeping. That's really smart. Sedated. You have a sleeping child a knife. Give the kid the wings. Yeah. No, the knife is what's sleeping. Yeah, the, the knife is sleeping. Possessed a child. Yeah. Great. You see, if you... <laughs> what a sleepy knife. Well, that didn't work. It's not supposed to put you all the way to sleep. It's just supposed to make you calm. What's the current, What's the current objective? Give the <laughs> kids something to play with. Oh, okay. I'm not going to throw anything away. I'm just going to air balloon it. Or <laughs> balloon it into the when you scroll up and it's stuck into the bottom of the chair. we got to give him something yeah. to... How about some... Uh, uh, lawn darts. What so, is that? So many types. Sarah, Sarah the, Harrison. the dog. Oh, the, the there he is. Oh, oh no! He's attacking oh, me. Oh no! He's attacking. Oh no! Put a balloon on that dog before. I'm you going to. But I can't. <laughs> I can't get him to stand still. Of course, he's going to attack Everybody me. Everyone wants to know what the game is called. It's called Scribble Knots. Julia, put it here. There goes oh. Cerebrus. Did he? No, oh, no. He's, he's still fighting in a pit. It. He's fighting need it. another balloon. Several balloons. One for each head. There you go. Yes. <laughs> oh, there you go. Oh, no. Oh, oh there no. You go. Oh, oh, it's Mike. Oh, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Maxwell is dead. No. Get that parting shot in. <laughs> no. If you put a balloon on me. Too he gave him too much time. He's not... He's still not airborne. My God. Another balloon. Another balloon. Hurry. <laughs> there, that ought to do it. Should oh, there you go. <laughs> he still bit me before he went. Good riddance. Okay, somebody said a stuffed rhino. A weird stuffed rhino. Okay. I feel like that's important. <laughs> there you go. I do too. Okay. <laughs> oh, yes, he he's on it. He's happy. He doesn't oh. seem to. That doesn't seem to impress him. We didn't get a star. Oh, you're supposed to get a star if it's successful. Yeah, yeah, it'll tell. Get him. Like right a, oh, he's, what's he gonna do? Like a, a taser? Matches. Give him some matches to play yeah. with. Do you see how he's weird? <laughs> <laughs> he's got sunglasses on that are two different colors. <laughs> there he goes. Oh, that rhino oh, is he's way too heavy. heavy. He's too heavy. The rhino's way too heavy for that. All right, well, here's what we're going to do. We're going to add an adjective here. Light. Uh, floating. <laughs> floating. Light. Wait. Light, wait. There you go. Yeah, yeah, there there you go. go. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we solved it. So somebody said matches, JT. <laughs> yeah, see if they'll burn. I don't the, think it does matches. I think it'll. I think it just doesn't match. Oh, Julia uh, says maybe it's because one of the kids died. Maybe. So we can't win this one. Oh, they're sad. Oh, we can win. <laughs> we, can. <laughs> we can win. We can fight. We can win. Uh, all right. We can try one of. Those. So what do we do? We can reset it. If we reset the level, he'll come back. Just try a beach ball. Something simple like that. Yeah, well, no, we'll he's definitely. Somebody he's said slinky. Definitely not, slinky, there you go. Not able to be won over if a slinky doesn't work. Oh, yeah. yeah um, this seems. He's sad. 
Poor thing. Well, see, there's no stairs. Oh, there's stairs to the right. Can oh, you can you? Yeah, there you go. Can you resurrect it? <laughs> can you resurrect the kid? What is that? Uh, it is a haunted house, after all. Well, I would think so, but the priest hasn't been any use to us, so he, <laughs> no, he, he would be the one that have the best you're, chance. You're just going to bring him to the pet cemetery, JT. And there then, you go. <laughs> and then he'll come back and he'll be just all right, so fine. We'll, and we'll reset, reset. Sometimes we'll reset dead's better, Judd. <laughs> Okay. Oh, look, they're both like. There they are. Okay. So okay, we gotta... now. Do they... we have to kill Still... kill that demon flying again? No. Oh, now okay. do the stuffed. How about a taser? Do the stuffed weird rhino now. <laughs> yeah, a taser. <laughs> hey, is that one of Dave Pendleton's dolls in the basement? <laughs> weird rhino. Oh. <laughs> oh, I know. I just why. don't know what's fun. I know right. why. Because we didn't, we didn't make it light. <laughs> Lightweight. Here we go. Nope. No. Uh, nothing. Still not having a good time. No, he's no more fun. still not enjoying it. What kid does it like a weird <laughs> rhino? Right. Lightweight. Re For real. Weird rhino too. Weird lightweight For rhino. Real. That uh, demon's back over there with yeah, the Yeah, that priest. demon is over there. So what do you want to do? What do you want to spray him with holy water? Can he can we yeah. have the demon play with the kids? Oh, that's an idea. <laughs> you know. Let's, we, we that's an kill idea. two birds to with one stone, two kids <laughs> with one demon. You know that old saying. Oh, look, it's a girl. It's Entertain a girl two kids with one demon. <laughs> oh everything, no. everything we make comes and punches me. <laughs> oh, well, you did do a demon. Oh, you know what dude, I mean? It's, it's not like you need a boy scout. Sketch. Right, right. Give them swords, frisbee, creepy clown. Frisbee, there you go. That's something they can throw back and forth. Oh, yeah, there's two of them. Why did you say... Uh, frisbee is a brand name. So yep. you have to... Um, flying disc. Flying disc. There you go. Flying disc. I'm sure this is good be interesting. It's just going to go straight up to the ceiling. Oh. Oh, cool. Oh! What? Yes! Come play it with worked. us. It worked. Mix, Mix and, and Mox. Look nice. Now we got a star right. We solved right, I don't, it. I don't see Juwan yet, which means we have to go upstairs. <laughs> okay. Or to the basement. Ooh, a creepy attic. This spider. spider wants to be more frightening, you guys. Ooh, okay. Um, make it large. Make it a gigantic spider. Mm. Mm. That would make it scarier. That would. That would. But let's let's put a let's put a mask on it first. Okay. <laughs> Masked. Hmm. That's that new. Um game show that they have on Fox, the Masked Spider. Yeah. <laughs> Give him a deep voice. What's, what's the difference between a mask and a party mask? Let's see what a fun mask is. It's a, oh, that looks I like know. V for Vendetta. V for Vendetta, yeah. What do they call those? Guy Fox? Guy, guy, yeah. Yeah. guy Fieri. Guy Fieri. <laughs> not to be confused with that guy. He's, he's not a lot scarier now, apparently. Give him a deep voice. Deep voice. <laughs> That's what Tabby said. Hey, baby. Okay. <laughs> That's either going to make it more scary or more romantic. I'm not sure. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'm not <laughs> sure. I don't think we can give him a deep voice. I've heard people say too many spider webs are no good for you. <laughs> but I don't know about that, baby. Well, now he has a deep voice. <laughs> <laughs> um. <laughs> Give the spider COVID. Uh, <laughs> give it roller skate disease. disease. Oh, oh, that won't work. I gotta, I gotta type. You have to type it on him. Make it a salesman. <laughs> Deep voice. Deep voiced. I'm gonna. I can't believe it worked. I'm gonna say uh. <laughs> Very wide of spiders. <laughs> oh, it made him sick. Oh, nice. Oh, no. Lethargic. He's actually less scary now that he can't move as well. Yeah. I'm going to take that away, and I'm going to say contagious. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Nice. Oh, he killed the kids! Oh, he my over... goodness. 
Love it. Door to door sales. <laughs> Brian, love it. Uh, <laughs> Make him door to door salesman. Uh, okay, so contagious isn't good. That's an adjective, though. Like, yeah, we need to be. Uh, um, uh, uh, like long-winded. A... Yeah. <laughs> uh. <gasps> what? what happened? Oh, I meant to throw me. That's not what we meant to do. But why did it that it work? Why did it multiply the spiders? I don't know. That's weird. That was great. So we made him long-winded. <laughs> Pat said we dressed him like a clown. A that would scare clown. a lot of people. Yeah. Shut up, Tabby. Uh. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> How come he's? How come the spiders aren't attacking Maxwell? I don't know. Oh, darling, I can't get enough of your web. What if, <laughs> what if we? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know why. Can't get enough of your web. <laughs> oh, web the eagles baby. eating them up. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Thank you, Mister. Oh. I wonder if I can suck him up with a balloon, too. <laughs> Bury the tarantula in kitty litter. <laughs> you know, Sherry, you should get an eagle, a pet eagle, to take care of your spider problem. There we go. <laughs> All right. All right. Uh, make the attic a bit more spooky. Nope. Oh, no problem. Oh, add a skeleton. <laughs> How do I get up there? There's a there's a star a, up a there. Rope? And I'm... Could you use a rope? Add like a, a Bob Ross. That's, that's a good idea. Or Danny DeVito. Or attach yourself no, you to can. a balloon. <laughs> I could attach myself to a balloon. <laughs> well, there you go. You can make a ladder. If you attached yourself to the rope. You got to. You attach it to the ceiling. This is going to take a very dark turn very soon. It is. <laughs> <laughs> you that... can't climb it when it's attached to your head. You just gave yourself a leash. You're now stuck. I need to, I need a to ladder? unattach it from my head. Okay. okay. Now you should... Climb do... it? Yeah. Do you climb it? I would think. Or tie it into a noose. That'll make it scary up there. You've been attaching everything to a balloon, but you're too good to ride in a balloon up to the attic. All right. <laughs> okay. Is there something that can launch him? Like a big giant slingshot? <laughs> <laughs> can I turn? I can blast my... Oh! There you go! That's you're in there. You're there! Perfect. <laughs> now shoot it. I was uh -oh. trying to use the slingshot to hit those you balloons. Click on the slingshot, not the balloon. Oh, it's. No. No. <laughs> no. Oh, that what was. What good is a slingshot? You can't shoot. So to get the star, you have to make the attic scary? Yeah. Okay. Well, I don't know. Uh, oh, there we go. Yep, there you go. Look how many shots it takes with that slingshot. That's the wow. most crappiest slingshot. <laughs> or maybe it's just a really strong balloon. Yeah. Come closer to the world's start. strongest balloon. Find, Find the, ghost. the ghosts. Set okay. Them free. Oh, okay. Oh, start. Is it timed? Yeah. Mm. There they go. The priest oh, no. is a ghost now? Well, he was. Attacked by the demon, right? That's true. We're just having all sorts of blasphemy in this game. Rid the house of ghosts who haunt it. First, give Maxwell something to help him see the supernatural. Hmm. What should we? What should we give him? Holy binoculars. <laughs> <laughs> One of the rejected uh, Batman and Robin phrases. <laughs> Holy, binoculars. Holy binoculars, Batman. 
He's got a holy, halo. Look at those holy binoculars. Everything, <laughs> everything that you say is holy. He just puts a halo on it. Those don't seem to be working, JT. What if okay. you did like a holy halo? Holy halo. <laughs> Try it. What, what do we... We'll, we'll, we'll have aviator goggles, ectoplasm detector. Ectoplasm detector. Perfect. An, an Illudium Q37 space modulator. It doesn't like the it doesn't like the detector. Okay. Ectoplasm show though, for sure. Yeah, that could do it. Boom. You got it. Ooh. He's just gonna carry like ectoplasm. Happening. It's like a big booger. Something's happening. Well, it's, ask, it's asking us if we want another clue. Miss Cleo. Miss Cleo. <laughs> <laughs> Drug. What are we going uh, to look at it with? Uh, ghost glasses. Well, it won't let us use the Bible. Ooh. There you go. Ghost glasses. Oh, interesting. The glasses are ghosts. See, you can kind of see through them. Um, so these uh, are the glasses a yeah. ghost would use. So it would be like a ghost detecting yeah. ghost detecting glasses or something. A flux like capacitor. Haley yeah. Joel Osment. <laughs> Type him in there. <laughs> Doesn't like wanna... flux or capacitor. Um, it's not going to take Haley Joe Jeff says EVP made meter. EVP meter. Mm. Ghost Hunter. Oh. Oh, look oh. at that. Okay. This looks like Dan Aykroyd. Give me three things to play with, and I will leave this house. So he found the first ghost. Yeah. Excellent. Okay. After we've already gone downstairs. Yeah. Back to the attic. Uh. Wait. Oops. It, we got to get rid of this ghost because it's going in my ear. We, we can't hear. <laughs> no. Why can't I go up there? How'd That's you get up there the first time? Because you don't time. have a balloon. Yeah, last time. I think I can another... give her... I don't have to go up there. I can just give her something. Something okay. to play with. What What does a ghost want to play with? Um, hmm. Hoverboard! Hoverboard! Etch -a -sketch. Hoverboard, sure. Yeah, I somebody said Etch-a-Sketch earlier. Ooh! I like that better. That's a brand name, though. It is. Yeah, yeah that's true. Uh, that's what I was afraid of. Easel. Maybe it's an artist. Do an Ebola. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe she'll draw. Oh, yeah. That might work. No. Mm. Take this easel. She's not artistically inclined. Uh, Legos. Oh, you can't use Legos. How about building blocks? Since or if you, you want, you can do like, you know, my parents. Oh, you want something to play with? Why don't you clean, why don't you clean the dishes? <laughs> there you go. Wash the dishes. So bored? <laughs> so bored goes? To, why don't you... Sherry's trying to say Ouija board, and she said wedgie board. Wedgie board. board. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> I'm typing that. A wedgie board? Darn it. Nope. Try, okay, do a doll so that we know if you can even hand it to her from where you are. Because... I don't think that you are close enough. Ah, yes, Stefan also said dolls. Okay, <gasps> that does Yay! work. All right, two more. Uh, she likes dolls, so um, how about... Well, now we got to find another ghost. I thought she needed three, she things, needs three, to things. three yeah. things to play with. Oh, so sorry. she'll leave. I wasn't paying attention. Because she's howling so loudly. Right, you know, she's scaring yeah. me. Okay. So she Paint likes ball dolls. Gun. Paintball gun. Ah. Done. Candy bar? <laughs> you eat those. You don't oh, look. How about that? Would she like it? Yes. How she about thumbtacks? Like what do you think? Thumbtacks. Kids love playing with thumbtacks. <laughs> Scissors. <laughs> <laughs> what is happening? She liked it. She likes the thumbtacks. No, tacks. she doesn't. You get a check mark when she likes it. Look how sad that thumbtack made her. <laughs> what? Kids love thumbtacks. <laughs> um, a glue stick. You used a U. That's, that's because that's British. what Stefan used. That's the British spelling. And Coloring. Canadian, too. Yes. That'll work. Yeah, surely. Like, 
Come on, ghost girl. Yes. Check, yeah. out. Check mark. So that's two. So we need okay. one more. Uh, what kind of well-adjusted <laughs> ghost girl likes coloring books but doesn't like thumbtacks? This is ridiculous. <laughs> Mr. Uh, Wilson goes, hey, is Juwan back yet? <laughs> no. He, he is thinks, not. He thinks the Mad Lib is going to be better than this. Uh, Super bouncy ball. Pet mouse. A dress. Ooh, she'll like that. Yep. Yeah. Yep. All right. Got it. Good. What's she want? I cannot leave this house till I get the wedding I longed for in life. Give me three things to set me free. A ring. <gasps> something old, oh. something new, something borrowed, <laughs> something blue. That's four. Surely she'd like a ring. Old. <laughs> old, blue, borrowed. <laughs> <laughs> Old, blue, <laughs> borrowed, new bouquet. car, bouquet, <laughs> broom. <Yeah. laughs> That's gonna freak it out to have old and new at the same time. <laughs> Something to rust at a groom. Yeah. Uh, Weird wedding guest. Uh, ring. <sighs> Old blue ring. I think we maybe put too many adjectives in there. Prenup. <laughs> prenup. <laughs> Old blue borrowed prenup. Darn it. Uh, prenuptial agreement. <laughs> That's what. <laughs> I don't know how to spell nuptial. I -L. I -L. Yeah, I didn't do it either. Lawyer. Old new. I mean, old borrowed blue lawyer. <laughs> Why is he crying? <laughs> He's oh, afraid he's scared. <laughs> it's a haunted house. <laughs> I gotcha. No. Oh, he fell down the stairs. <laughs> and now he'll be floating. Shortly. Um, well, the lawyer's going to sue us. You know who can probably. marry people is uh, captains, ship captains. Yeah. He's not going to take a captain. Give her a captain. <laughs> <laughs> Give it. <laughs> Yes! Oh, yes! Nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I think he's a ghost, though, so she's probably going to marry him. That's who him. she's going to marry, yeah. Oh. So, okay. so what else do we need? She's still sad a ring. Tenille. You need a tenille as well. <laughs> <laughs> Which is for Captain and Tenille, for those who have, don't understand. Yes. It. I'll just give her teddies yeah. and see if that works. Nope, nope uh, she doesn't need those. Um, let's see, what else does she need? Nah, rice. We'll Give her rice. Together. Blue rice. Blue rice. Yes! That worked. It worked. <laughs> Best How about ever. borrowed shoes? <laughs> <laughs> Darn it. Oh no. <laughs> That looks like the tinnies. That yes! works! Yes! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Off on their hunting moon. Uh, trapped here a long time. Three so relics, relics, relics of the, of the Holy, Holy Church. Church. Holy water, of course. I don't know this. Gotta go Wasn't back to Holy water. Wasn't there a grilled cheese sandwich that had Jesus' face on it? Yeah. Grilled Jesus. <laughs> What's his name from the 700 Club? <laughs> oh, yeah, Pat. Pat, Pat uh, Robertson. Robertson, yeah. He's not impressed with the grilled cheese. Just holding it. <laughs> it's not gonna uh, take Robertson. Paul Robertson. Who's yeah, that? Paul Robertson. Is, you Paul think Robertson. that's close enough? Yeah. Let's see. I don't know who that is. <laughs> Everyone knows Paul Robertson. <laughs> there he Pat's is. Son. A crusading uh, knight. Holy Grail. That probably will work. Yeah, the Holy Grail for sure. The Pope. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta try the Pope. <laughs> Oh, no! darn it. oh, the Popo. -po. Oh, po. <laughs> so disappointed. Holy Grail. Do none. Do a none. That'll work. Yeah. Yes. Okay, that, was, that worked better than <laughs> the grilled Jimmy cheese. Jimmy Baker. Uh... <laughs> Billy Graham. <laughs> nope. No. What's some, uh, some, something <laughs> else that gamma. people like? Ah, uh, the old bulky gamma. <laughs> <laughs> Holy mackerel. <laughs> Holy mackerel. <laughs> oh my goodness. 
<laughs> it's alive. If it checks it out. <laughs> uh, a relic of the church. The holy mackerel word. Oh, holy mackerel. And rosary beads. And yeah, try the rosary critic. beads. Okay. Yeah. Well, I'm sure that'll work. Surely yeah. that will work. Communion bread. Mm-hmm. Uh, a hymn. <laughs> uh, it doesn't have to be borrowed anymore. Well, I just want to make sure. All right. Uh, nice. Uh, now there's one uh, more ghost. I've been in the house longest of all. Give me three things I wanted in life so I can finally leave. What kind of ghost is he? He's a knight. He's like a knight. Kind of a... Uh, give him good life. Oh, defeated. no. How did that happen? Did the ghost hunter just kill that ghost? I think so. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> the ghost hunter we left downstairs just stabbed our Right, ghost. but if we, re if we retry, it's going to make us start all over again. Will it? Yeah. Oh, man. We may have to save this for next week. Okay. Oh, look at... There's some stinkiness. All right, I the see Juwan. Still. I see Juwan is back. He is. It's pr it's pr what time is it? Is it like 9 o'clock yet? It's like 8.15, <laughs> pretty much. Yeah. I'm removing this. Yeah. Okay. And we'll put Juwan in and see if anything happens. Can you hear us? <laughs> yes. <gasps> so there's a delay, but he can hear us. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Can, you can hear us. <laughs> oh, you can hear <laughs> He said, you know yeah, what? but I think there's a delay. Yeah. There's a there's a big <laughs> delay, but you I, know what? Oh. <laughs> yes, he's frozen. Juwan looks okay. stressed. And he's that frozen. was the last time we saw Juwan. <laughs> and that was the last of Juwan It's Juwan's all right, Juwan. Juwan. We'll try again in the <laughs> effort party. Um, all, all we're going to do right now is the snappy wrap-up. We're going to do a snappy we'll wrap-up 10 you minutes late. join us in the after party. So, so what does that look like? Well, tonight I was hoping... Oh, I didn't put the banner up. Hang on. I have, I have to stop this. You're seeing, you're seeing it happen in real time tonight, folks. All right. It's all happening in real time. I'm hoping that we'll do JT's snappy wrap up and he can just sing a verse and a All right. and the chorus of the stay away song. So we'll say goodbye to John, see him in the effort party, say goodbye to Brian. And then I can't remember where I put my video. And this is once again not gonna be able to see your face, but we'll see the I'm going to do the snappy wrap up for everybody here. I'll fill your hearts with terror and I'll fill your soul with fear. Jenny Anderson and Troy Batis, Justin Broby, <laughs> I'm singing for you. And Randy Epps and Corey Hall and Brenda and Sarah and Monty King and Melanie McGuire. Jeffrey Niven, Chance Rogers and Olivia Rugg Rock, Nathan Snell and Kevin Thatcher and Elaine Williams and Larry York. Stay away from all these people <laughs> later on. Bye. Good night, everyone.